Same question, just a different product. Okay. This would be... Go with your gut. Go with your gut. What are you thinking? I want to say one of the Hallow... Yep, one of the Hallows. Yeah, one of those ones. I will take it. Okay. (laughs) Hallow Hydra. Okay. I know, this is difficult to see. Um, And this goes back again... It was these that you were thinking of. Yes. This one actually has ether in the name when there is an OR group. Uh-huh. This one has a mean in the name. This one, I'd say, is the trickier one that you're like, I don't that know how that refers one. to. Right. But this is this is the one we're looking for mm-hmm. with the alcohol uh-huh. and the alkyl halide or the halogen. Okay. So, okay, great. I know it's that, and I technically just gave you the answer. <laughs> uh, but it's going backwards now. And this is where it's important to remember, does this follow Markovnikov's rule? Does oh. it follow anti-Markovnikov's rule? Mm-hmm. You know? And the other thing, since we're looking for the alkene, mm-hmm. this one I would actually say is is easy because... It this gives it its, this bond. Exactly. That's what I was thinking. It gives it away because mm-hmm. I already have the bromine and the OH. That's mm-hmm. where I had to have added... Whatever, you know, it was in, in the, yeah, yeah, exactly. Like the alkene right. was already there. So let's go ahead and build it. Okay. I'm going to scooch this guy over. And I want you to look at something. How many carbons are here? How many carbons are here? There is one carbon here. And there's zero on that one. Yep. So, so I want. So that if it doesn't live in on the product side, mm-hmm. that's wrong. If we do not have oh. the same amount of carbons oh, from reactants to products, where did they go? Yeah, okay. They weren't there to begin with. Oh, so that would have been the reagent part? Yes. Okay. Same thing here. This is not a methyl. Oh, I see That's what you're saying. That's not a is, yeah. And this goes back to just the reaction itself. This was telling us that the double bond was here, but we hadn't had added mm-hmm. the bromine or the OH yet. Right. Right? That happens with our reagent. Oh, I see exactly what you're saying. Okay. It's just uh, this one. Uh-huh. Where it's dependent on whatever I have as a halogen, so BR. bromine. Mm-hmm. So okay, that had to have been BR two with water. Makes sense. Because that water gives mm-hmm. us the alcohol. Right. That's it. And then oh. this also goes back. I mean, this was this one. I'd say eh, it doesn't necessarily matter because Markovnikov's rule is still going to apply. Like uh-huh. it's you know this is it's still natural. right. So mm-hmm. this is still secondary. It's still secondary. Yeah. Oh, I see. Mm-hmm. I, I'm going to have that double bond there regardless. Mm, yeah. But main thing was just knowing. Okay, where is that double double bond going to be? Has to be in the middle here. Yeah. And then don't get tricked by placing those bonds. Extras. There's no carbon here mm-hmm. to begin with, so there's no carbon there.